Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Retro 1951 Hexomatic Ballpoint Pen. And I'm kind of excited to take a look at it. So I guess the question is, barcode specifies writing instrument inside. All right. That is a super close up for y'all. Uh, ballpoint, black ballpoint, Hexomatic. Alright, let's open this thing up and take a look at it. I kind of feel as if I'm supposed to tear on the dotted line there. Alright. So let's open this thing up and take a look. I'm seeing a hex theme here. Ooh. Kind of a neat looking pin. It definitely has a style to it. Has a hex shaped thing there. I'm sorry. The barrel is hex shaped here. It has some knurling right there. And. Ooh. Feels pretty good. So, this is the Retro 1951 Hex O Matic. I'm pretty sure you gotta like say that in kind of a hexomatic kind of way. Hmm. Doesn't write too bad. Uh, according to what I saw online, this has a Schmidt Easy Flow 9000 M cartridge, and so it should take Parker Jotter style refills, I believe. Let's open this thing up and take a look. All right, that spring and that. Okay. So it does, this looks like a normal jotted refill. Let me grab something. Well, actually, I can just grab a Parker jotter. And we can try the refill out of that. So if the refill out of this works, then you have a ridiculous number of options. Okay, looks like the same size. And try it out. So since this appears to take the usual standard Parker refills, you can put all kinds of refills in there. There is no shortage of options. And if you want to, since this is this is a pretty hardy pen and I'm pretty sure it's all metal. So if you want to like have your everyday carry pen be like a you want like a use a Fisher refill like one of the space pen refills you can easily do that because their refills are Parker Jotter compatible so let's see this one is a Monteverdi one Monteverdi I think this one is pink you can probably guess that from the color hmm. I like the pen it's real comfortable not bad it has a good weight um, I'll put a link in the description if you want to check out the pen. Hmm. Neat pen. I like it. Um, hmm. I don't know. I think this is definitely the kind of pen I think I'm going to give it a shot. See how I like carrying it. My only problem with adding pens to what I carry is I carry a couple of Parker Jotters every day. And I have the issue of having my pins match. So I'm thinking if I like this, I might need to get like three of it. But it's a neat pin. I mean, it feels it feels really comfortable to write with. It takes a very common refill. There's a lot of good going for this pin. And it's solid. 
Definitely not a bad pen. Um, if any of y'all have have this pen and like it, or if there's something I'm missing about this pen, and let me know in the comments. And if there are any pens or anything else you think I should check out, let me know. And anyway, if you have enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and I hope you all have an excellent day.